President-elect Joe Biden adding another win on his way to the White House. NBC News can now confidently project that Georgia will go to Joe Biden. A state last won by a Democrat in 1992. Biden's latest victory means he flipped five states President Trump won in 2016. The president-elect racking up 306 electoral college votes, the same total President Trump claimed four years ago. Biden's transition team barreling ahead. But President Trump's ongoing refusal to concede the race is complicating Biden's pandemic planning. Until the Trump administration formally recognizes Biden as president-elect, outgoing Trump officials can't share critical COVID vaccine distribution plans with the incoming Biden team. Biden's newly minted chief of staff speaking on MSNBC this week. So the sooner we can get our transition experts into meetings with the folks who are planning that vaccination campaign, the more seamless the transition from a Biden presidency to a Trump presidency can be. Biden advisors have been working on their own plan to mass distribute a COVID vaccine so they won't be left unprepared come January. Biden's transition in touch with CVS and Walgreens, making sure the retail pharmacies have the staffing and supplies needed to vaccinate millions of Americans, a source familiar tells NBC News. So the bottom line is this. Less than 10 weeks before Joe Biden takes office, his team is locked out of critical COVID data and contacts, and that threatens to cripple the future federal response as COVID cases surge across the country. Kristen, Peter? Jeff Bennett this morning in Delaware for us. Jeff, thanks.